So the top five tech frenzy continues, and this time we're looking at the best gaming mechanical keyboards that you can currently buy under 50 bucks. Let's do this. At number one, we have the Red Dragon K553 keyboard with cherry green switches. It's constructed out of aluminum and ABS materials with plate mounted mechanical keys. They will give you excellent responsiveness and tactile feedback. The WASD and arrow keys can be swapped out for custom keycaps and the keyboard features a Windows lock option with red LEDs which can be adjusted from the keyboard. What I love about this keyboard is the minimalistic design. There are no extra macro keys off to the side that extends the width of the keyboard. You only get the essential keys that you need. The small compact size of this keyboard plus the fact that it's under 50 bucks makes it a great buy. At number 2 we have the Arion Rapu V500. This one is a good looking keyboard with MX black switches and the keyboard's chassis is made out of plastic so you don't get any aluminum here but what you get is a small compact solid gaming keyboard with subtle backlighting. The keyboard also comes with its own software program which you can use to program each key and it does feature a windows lock key as well. The only downside is that it does not have any LED color options so if you don't care for those fancy options then this keyboard will do just fine for you. There's also a white version of the keyboard which looks pretty damn cool. This next keyboard is a very popular one from ASIO and it's one of the best budget mechanical keyboards available in the market right now. As of now there's only one left in stock and it features blue key switches with a gunmetal grey aluminum faceplate with a detachable wrist rest. The keyboard also features white LED backlight and the brightness can be adjusted on the keyboard. You get the standard windows lock key, anti-ghosting and full key rollover on USB. There's also a wheel on the top right which is used to control the volume. Honestly with all the features this keyboard comes with including the awesome aluminum build. 50 bucks seems like a steal right now. At number 4 we have the Rosewill keyboard. Who would have thought that you can get a mechanical gaming keyboard for only 30 bucks? The Rosewill RK6000 features ALSP blue switches. It also has a plastic chassis with rubber coated WASD and arrow keys for a better grip. The only downside to this keyboard is the fact that it doesn't have any backlighting, windows lock key or even a wrist rest so I kind of wonder why it's labeled as a gaming keyboard. Nonetheless, if you want to make the switch to a mechanical keyboard or want to buy one that's extremely affordable, this is it guys, you get what you pay for. Next up is the Aula Wings of Liberty keyboard. It features blue switches and has a metal chassis. The keyboard also features 26 keys for anti-ghosting and a windows lock key with a small wrist rest. The keys also have a rubber anti-slip coating with a silicone gel membrane cover on every single switch making this keyboard water spill and dust resistant. Once again the keyboard doesn't have any backlighting and the palm rest is way too short especially for people with larger hands. But if you're looking for an all white gaming keyboard to match your setup then this is your best option. So on to the high roller section of the video and these two keyboards are for people with a slightly larger budget. At number 6 we have the CM Storm Quickfire keyboard with Cherry MX Red switches. Full N key rollover and USB mode, full LED backlit with 3 modes and 5 brightness levels to choose from. It also has a full metal backplate, a windows lock key and a detachable braided USB cable. All the good features you come to expect from a mechanical gaming keyboard. Last on my list is the Logitech G710 keyboard with Cherry MX Blue switches as well. You get 6 programmable G keys, 110 anti-ghosting keys with a 26 key rollover feature. The keyboard also has white LED backlighting which is adjustable and you get a USB pass through for connecting a headset or other USB devices. I definitely like the included detachable wrist rest and the fact that it comes with a USB pass through. So those are my top picks for the best gaming mechanical keyboards you can buy under 50 bucks. Let me know if you guys enjoyed this series by hitting a like and I will continue to do these. Uh, but let me know what I should feature in my next top 5 video by dropping a comment down below. I'm actually gathering a list together for you guys. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.